booking baby. Uh, for this one, um, if you happen to notice that the baby is having troubles breathing or turning kind of blue but still conscious, um, uh, you can yell for, yell for help or, or if you need to. Uh, we want to grab the baby. Be careful with the neck because the muscles are still developing. So what you want to do is uh, grab the baby around the front of the neck using the webbing of your hand on the, on the chin and on the back of the head with the other hand. In this position, there's the chin and the head. And your forearms are going to align the body like this and keep it in perfect alignment. You're going to take the baby and again if you're standing uh, you can do this. Uh, keep the head down so the food will help or whatever the obstruction is will go um, with gravity down. First you want to do your five back blows uh, between the uh, scapulas in the back uh, with the heel of your hand. One, two, three, four, five. Still obstructed. Make sure you have the baby secured. Turn the baby over. Once you have it in posi correct position, uh, you're going to use your uh, ring finger down the middle of the nipple line, and then your middle finger and your first finger are going to go in the center of the chest, and you're going to get five abdominal thrusts at the depth of uh, one half to one inch, one and two and three and four and five. If the baby is still choking, you would just repeat these maneuvers, again stabilizing the head as you turn the baby. One, two, three, four, five. Grab the head and back. Stabilize it. Find your hand placement with the ring finger on the nipple line. Two fingers below that. One, two, three, four, five. You just continue that back and forth until they become conscious or obstru obstruction comes away. If they go unconscious, you do something a little bit different. Someone else comes to relieve you or you get exhausted.